awesome. I've learned so much in such a short period of time, even just day one. He keeps talking about light bulb moments. I would say they're like floodlight moments. You know, really. Hopefully I'll be much better and I will practice and implement my technique, what I've learned, and be ready to come back and improve again. I like the way you work it, no diggity. I got a bag. Awesome to stay. Heaps of nice people, awesome food. People are do anything for you. So you really don't have to, but everyone gets along nicely. Alright. Um, I was surprised at how many uh, just very basic rudimentary things like my pop-up and surf stance you know, needed. And uh, I, you know, I just wanted to say something about the, the dedication to coaching. Um, Clayton, Late one afternoon, I was heading out, walking downstairs, and Clayton was walking up, and he had been out the entire day and uh, barely making up the stairs. And uh, he got to the top, and he took five minutes with me just to go over some things and some correct some issues that I had struggled with, and um, you know immediately helped. And, and Chris, Chris touched me in the bathing suit area, um, and I liked it. I'm Dave. I'm Dave. And I'm Dave. Because I've got... <laughs> <laughs> Where's the... Uh, Where's the, the mic? <laughs> <laughs> One word. How do you describe macaroni? in the off-season? Super fun. Unreal. But before I met Chris, I thought you know, he was a really tough guy from his internet videos. <laughs> and you know, he was going to be all macho. But really, he's just a sensitive, nice guy. <laughs> I love you, Chris. <laughs> <laughs>